This is not the first time that I've been asked about my Sarah headdress. I'm going to do my best to talk about how I made it. Since it's already made, I can't really do a progress video, but I just thought I would show an up close version of the back of the headdress just kind of give you an idea of what I did. So I started off with these little tiny alligator hair clips um, and a bunch of flowers and things I found at a thrift store. Um, I found this floral wire that was wrapped in white paper and used that as kind of the structure for these like ear pieces and I all hot glued it and some ribbons all together. This is some jewelry wire that is just kind of bunched up and secured with a little hairpin and I was able to just kind of clip it to the wig and it, it got a little tangled in there but it holds really well. Then um, in the movie you can see she has a lot of ribbons in her hair and so I decided to just attach those to another wire that is kind of hidden under the hair but it's a good, made a good place to put all these ribbons on without actually attaching them into the hair. And it wraps all the way around the back of the head so that it kind of makes one sort of back of the head headband. Um, I have this wire again attached with a hairpin. And then this is a repeat of the other side with another alligator clip and the same flowers and ribbons. So hopefully that helps you make your own version. This is not an exact recreation of the movie, but it works well enough for running through the Goblin King's castle. <laughs> 